Hi guys, Jess from Reach HQ here. I hope you're well. And as always, if you need anything, please just reach out. I am here to help. That is my job. So, what I wanted to talk about today is one of the absolute fundamentals that I must master with any client, and that is their time. And after mindset, Time is the most important thing that I've got to get on top of with my clients because that will be the thing that determines their success. It really correlates every single time. And we have shared plenty of videos about time and we will always do that uh, because there are so many tools out there that we need to use. However, what I wanted to talk about today is um, the phrase that I hear from a lot people, not just clients, but people in general, sometimes I fall into the trap of saying this, and that is, I didn't have enough time. I didn't have enough time. And the phrase that I counter back with, with everyone that ever says that to me, is there's more than enough time. There's more than enough time. And sometimes people can get really upset <laughs> when I say that to them because they're feeling that they've just been right up against it. They've used every second that they could have done in that time frame and they still haven't managed to get everything ticked off their list. Well, when I say there's more than enough time, what I mean by that is you chose to prioritize something else. You see, there was more than enough time, but you chose to use it on something else. And people say, no, I had this, I had this, I had this, it was nonstop, I had no time to breathe. And I counter by saying, well, did you eat that day or that week or that month? And they'll say, yeah, of course I did. And I said, well, there was more than enough time. And they look at me quite puzzled. And I do know that this is a quite extreme example, but sometimes you have to make extreme examples to have really, really hammer home a point. What I'm trying to say is that if you ate, well, I'm, I'm not a doctor, but I know that if you didn't eat for a day, um, you're not going to die. A lot of people actually do that with their, uh, with their, with their intermittent fasting uh, regimes. So, so when you chose to eat something instead of do that task, whatever it may have been, you chose to prioritize something else, meaning therefore that there was more than enough time to get that task done. And what I'm trying to do is instill that mindset that let's stop giving ourselves excuses. Let's stop saying there wasn't enough time because there was. We chose to prioritize something else. And when we have that mindset shift, it's incredibly liberating and it stops us, if, we, if there was a risk, of making excuses for everything and anything. So, have a think about it. There's more than enough time. What am I prioritizing uh, and what's important and what isn't? So I hope that's got you thinking. I hope it's helped. If it has, please do feel free to comment below and feel free to share this video. In the meantime, stay safe and stay healthy.